Thank you for joining us, and welcome to the Faith in Grace Ministries video broadcast, where the peace of God is taking over your troubles, with Apostle Willie Williams. And now, here's today's message. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Listen, while you're still standing at your Bibles, go with me to the book of John. Hallelujah. Amen. I want to thank God for our guests again, for coming in and joining Amen. us. Hallelujah. Go with me to the book of John, Gospel according to John. Hallelujah. The 16th chapter. Hallelujah. Amen. This is Jesus speaking here. Amen. Talking to his disciples. Say his disciples. Amen. Talking to his disciples. And he said, I have still many things to say to you, but you are not able to bear them or to take them upon you or to grasp them. Now say grasp. Amen them now watch this 13 but when he yeah. the Holy Spirit yeah. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. I love it but when he the Holy Spirit that's in the Amplified yeah. amen the, 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 watch this the truth giving spirit comes yeah. he will guide you into all the truth, the whole, the full truth. For he will not speak of his own message. Uh oh. Mm. Did, did, did you hear what I'm saying? He will not speak of his own message on his own authority. Oh Lord. But he will tell whatever he hears. From the Father. He will give the message that has been given to him. Say given to him. And he will announce and declare to you the things that are to come. And declare to you the things that are to come that will happen in the future. Amen. Glory to God. Why are you taking your seats? Amen. Glory to God. I want to begin to talk on the subject. Amen. The revelation by God's spirit. Hallelujah. Revelation by God's spirit. First of all, amen, we saw the ministry of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The ministry of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Bible said that he comes to lead us and to guide us into all of the truth. Amen. Watch this. Also, it was added that he will not speak of his own self. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now, I'm not, I, I haven't come to, 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 uh, 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 to cast shade on other ministries. No, I'm not doing that. Amen. Glory to God. But most of the time when you go into our charismatic churches, amen, glory to God, what they're doing is they're always getting the Holy Spirit to move rather than hearing the word of God. They want you to move. Amen. They want you to dance. They want you to shout. Amen. And they call that the spirit. Amen. But that's not the spirit. That's emotions. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. So so the thing about it is that what they want you to do. Amen. Is it. Amen. The Holy Spirit this and the Holy Spirit that and the, and the Holy Spirit. Come on now. The Holy Spirit ain't trying to shine no light up on itself. Amen. Come on. Glory to God. But the Holy Spirit only comes to do what? To give you what God has spoken and said. He come to bring you the revelation of Christ Jesus. Amen. A 
of the who? The truth. Now listen what it said. The spirit of the truth. Oh. Look at what it said. He said, and the spirit of the truth. Who is the truth? Christ Jesus is the truth. He said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Oh. Oh, wait a minute now. So we talking about this is the spirit of Christ. So why would the spirit of Christ not talk about the spirit of Christ? Hallelujah. <laughs> Glory to God. I'm gonna teach you about myself. Because that's what that's what Christ come to do. I'm come to teach you about me. Ain't that what he did with the Apostle Paul? The Bible said, uh, 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 and, 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 the, and Paul said, listen, he said, I wasn't taught this. Watch this. I wasn't taught about the word of God by no man. No man didn't teach me this. He said, but I was taught by Christ himself. Oh, my God. He said, it was revealed to me by Christ himself. What that tells me, that it was the spirit of God that revealed it to him. Oh, come on now. Hallelujah. Glory to God. The, the Holy Spirit, he brings about the revelation mm -hmm. of Christ Jesus yes. to us. Why? Yes. So when we, so the grace of, oh, first of all, it comes, amen, watch it, so that we amen. can be more uh, uh, rooted and grounded, mm -hmm. amen, amen mm -hmm. in the teaching, yeah. mm -hmm. amen, in who Christ is. Yes. He come to reveal his love. He come to show us, amen, everything, glory to God, that he's done, amen, what we call the gospel. What is the gospel? The, the good news. The good news, amen. amen. What, 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 is the, what is the name of the gospel? The word of God, Christ. Ah, it's called the gospel of grace. It's called the gospel of the grace of God. Hallelujah. Now, what is the grace of God? He's Christ Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Prove it to you. Yes. Ephesians yes. 2, 8 and 9. Mm -hmm. Amen. What did it say? Amen. For by faith. Grace. grace. Oh, yeah. Grace. Yes. For by grace yes. are you saved. Yes. Did he say that? Yes. How, how I get saved? By grace. By grace. Well, grace has a name. Jesus. I'm saved through Jesus Christ. For by Jesus Christ. am I saved. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Through my faith. Through my faith in what? In him. Jesus. Oh my God. Amen. Not of my works. Words, oh, not of my own self. Now, yeah. I didn't get myself saved through my actions and through my righteous actions. For the Bible says, my my righteousness is as filthy rags. Yeah. So I can't get myself clean. I can't get myself right. Amen. Don't say I, when I get myself right, then I'm gonna come to church. I'm gonna get myself together. You can't do it, baby. Come on now. The only thing. Oh, oh. So I just come to tell you that 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 Christ come to reveal Himself to you through His Spirit, through which is Himself. Hallelujah! Watch this. Number one, God's Spirit only speaks to your born again spirit. Let's go to the Book of John, John ten, chapter ten. We still in John. Let's go to chapter ten. Hallelujah. Chapter 10. Hallelujah. He only speaks to your born again spirit. Now, when we when, when we think about this, there's another word, amen, that we use for the uh God's spirit. Amen. Amen. And it is called, amen, the anointing. Amen. The anointing. Hallelujah. Now, this 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 word anointing. Amen. Glory to God. It, it is what we call Cairo. Amen. It, it is a Greek word called Cairo. C uh, C H I R O. Amen. Cairo. Amen. Watch this. And and what it means, glory to God. It means, Amen. To to uh, to smear. Amen. It means to smear. Amen. Uh, 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 to anoint. Amen. 
and, and, and in other words, it just simply means, amen, to be chosen, to be picked out. Yeah. Amen. amen. To be picked out. You've, you've, you've been anointed. Yes. Amen. So therefore, now watch this. You have been anointed means to be picked out. Anointing, which means, glory to God, the ability to carry out, yes. amen, uh, 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 the, the authorities in that office yes. that yes. you have been anointed for. Yes. Amen. So it is Christ, the Holy Spirit, <laughs> that enables you to do what you do. He said he will both give you what? The will and the do. Hallelujah. So watch this. God's Spirit only speaks to your spirit. Let's look at it again. Amen. Romans, I mean, uh, John 10. Let's look at uh, 3 through 5. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Three through five. Hallelujah. Look at what it says, y'all. To him, the porter opened it, and the sheep hear his voice. And he called it his own sheep by name and leadeth them out. And when he put it forth his own sheep, he go forth before them. And the sheep follow him, for they know his voice. And a stranger will they not follow. But will flee from them, him, for they know not the voice of the stranger. Listen what it says. In other words, we know when we're, when we're getting revelation from God. We know when we're hearing God's voice. Amen. Glory to God. Can I tell you something? Can you look at the scripture? Look what it said. It said that it didn't say that uh, his sheep uh, can know his voice. They know. They know. They know. Uh, it didn't say that. It, 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 it say his sheep knows his voice. See, most of the time, glory to God, when God is speaking to us and telling us some stuff, based upon our behaviors, based upon some things that we've done and, and, uh, and or whatever, we say, well, I don't know if it was God that was speaking to me. No, the Bible says his sheep know his voice. In other words, that word no simply means to be is intimate with him. You cannot become intimate with God, glory to God, without spending some time. Hallelujah. So he said, my sheep know my voice. Only them that are in, 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 in be like, you know, I don't know if God, glory to God, that's that because they haven't been spending no time with him. Come on now, you know I'm. I, you know I spend time with my wife. Yeah. Come on now, yeah. you, you know for her to just, for her to know me, for yeah. me to know her. I, yeah. I spend time. Am I right? Yeah. We spend time with each other. Yeah. Amen. 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 Glory to God. You know what I'm saying? We we we. You know we we we. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We spend time with each other. Amen. Glory to God. Glory to God. Now look what it said. Galatians six and eight. If you want to, if you want to have this spiritual connection with God, because that's what it has to be. It has to be a spiritual connection. Because the Bible said, to the flesh, reap of the flesh. But to the spirit, reap of the spirit. Amen. Amen. And then Galatians 6 and 8 say? Right. Amen. Galatians 6 and 8. Amen. The Spirit receives from the Holy Spirit. In other words, watch this here. It says that, you know, we have been born again. In other words, we have a regenerated spirit. Amen. Glory to God. When, when God saved you, when Jesus, when God saved you through his son, through his blood, through the confession of your faith, Romans 10, 9 and 10. Hallelujah. Watch this. At that point, you had a born again spirit. Right. It did not affect your soul. Mm -hmm. And it did not affect your body. Alright. You are a born again spirit. That lives in a body. That possesses a soul. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Glory to God. So when you got saved. When God saved you. He only saved your spirit. Mm -hmm. 
He only gave you a brand new spirit, which we call a brand new heart. Yes. Amen. Glory to God. Now that, that flesh thing be. He gave you a brand new heart, which is your spirit. Yes. Amen. Now watch this. So that is what God communicates with. Yes, yes. Oh, 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 communicates with and to. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Watch this. Through his spirit. Yes. Right. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Mm -hmm. okay. Amen. The spirit, mm -hmm. which is the Holy Spirit. Christ speaks to the, his spirit. His spirit then communicates to our born again spirit. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory to God. So there have to be a spiritual. Now watch this now. But we always talking about, you know what, you know, you, you know, you, 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 you often heard people say, you know what? Uh, I, I think it's the Lord. I guess it's the Lord that, you know, I went with my first mind. There's no such thing as a first mind. I should have went with my first mind. My first thought. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. Something told me. <laughs> something told me not to go down there. We always call it no Lord or something. <laughs> and we always call it, you know what I mean? And we always call it an idiot. Amen. We always call it him an eating or something. Amen. It told me not to go. Eat it. He's a, he's a person. The Holy Spirit is a person. Person of Christ Jesus. Amen. Glory to God. So God speaks only to your born again spirit according to John. Amen. 10 and 13. 10 and uh, uh, 10. Amen. 3 through 5. And also the natural man only knows natural things. Look at what he said. You own, a natural man only knows natural things. Glory to God. Watch this. If I go to school and I proceed through 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 some teaching, then I got that through natural understanding. Right. Through natural knowledge. Mm -hmm. Amen. Okay. And that, that and, and that come that come only through a, to the, from flesh to flesh. to the flesh. The Bible said, "What knows a man mm -hmm. except what the spirit of a man?" Mm -hmm. Huh? Why? A man knows a man. You ever heard say a man know a man? A man, a man knows a man. A man know another man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A woman knows another woman. Yeah. 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 Amen. Right. But only the spirit yeah. knows God. Hallelujah. And the Bible says, yeah, even the deep things of God. <laughs> now watch this now. Let's not get it confused and twisted when he say, yeah, even the deep things. Now when he, now, when he say he's talking about the deep things, yeah. he's just talking about things that are not revealed. Yeah. yeah. That's what he's talking about. Yeah, even the things that are not revealed yet. Yeah. He knows about those things. Yeah. Why? Because he is there. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Amen. Amen. So that's all he's saying. Mm -hmm. We talk about deep things. Oh, you let get deep. Mm. No, that's not what he's talking about. No, no. It's just unrevealed knowledge yeah, yeah, is what he's saying. Yeah. Come on now. Yeah. God is not trying to hide nothing Perfect. from no, no person. Yeah. Amen. Come on now. He said, if you seek me, he said, you're going to find me. Right, yeah. That's yeah. right, ain't it? Come Amen. And, and, and can I tell you something? Yeah. We, just left, we just left out of a, 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 a teaching. Amen. We've been teaching on faith. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Everything that you receive from yeah. God through yeah. his Holy Spirit yeah. is by faith. Yeah. Right. Yes. Everything. Yeah. Every revelation. Yeah. Man, that everything that you know, you received it by faith. Yeah. Man, that's true. You received it by faith. How did you get the Holy Spirit? By faith. By faith. Yeah. God said, if you seek me, you shall find me. Hallelujah. How did, how, how, hey, why did you seek him? To find To find No, no. Why did you seek him? Because you had faith that you were going to find him. You had faith that he was going to reveal it to you. That's true. Amen. Hallelujah. All right. Watch this now. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. John 4 and 4. Say that God is a spirit and they that worship him. Yes. Must worship him. Yes. In spirit yes. and in truth. Yes. You can't you can't you can't worship him in the flesh. Watch this. Let's, 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 let's talk about it. You got to worship him well in what? In spirit and in truth. Oh. Can I can I go on to you? You got to worship him 
in Christ. Because this is, Christ is the Spirit, Holy Spirit. He is your regenerated Spirit. Watch this. And He is truth. When you worship Him, you worship Him in Spirit and in truth. You worship Him in Christ Jesus. You can't worship Him no other way. No man can come to the Father. Come on, come on, come on. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So them that worship him, you must. You can't worship him through your flesh. You can't worship him according to the law. According to your works. A lot of people tell me, well, you know, well, we don't, we don't, we don't do the law around here. Uh, 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 around here, no, we don't do the law. We don't. We don't do that around here. Glory to God. No, we don't do that. Amen. And what we try to do is we try to get us out of this law mentality. See, now, see, when we talk about the law all the time, glory to God, we're not just simply talking about the rituals and the rites and the things of the Jewish customs and stuff like that. Amen. Amen. Because we don't trust in that anymore. We trust in Christ Jesus because all those things was a foretaste. It was just a shadow and a type of Christ. Now, you can still operate under that law mentality. You know what it is? If you do this, then God going to do that. Wow. No, get out of that. Come on now. Come on, Pastor. If I go in there and I fast and I pray and I seek him, then God's going to talk to me. No, you got the Spirit of God in there. The Bible said that Christ Jesus is already with you. The Bible said Christ Jesus is our sanctification. Christ Jesus is our just. Come on now. Christ Jesus, watch this, is our holiness. I don't do things to be holy. I do things, amen, because I am holy. Hallelujah. 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 Can we, can we talk? Can we be for real? Yeah. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 So we just so yeah, yeah, everything that we obtain, we obtain it by faith. Even the revelation knowledge that we get, we obtain it by faith. Mm -hmm. Glory to God. And so therefore, when we worship God, we must worship Him through spirit and, and in truth. Watch it. There must be a spiritual connection in the spirit between the worshiper of God and God Himself. That, what is that spiritual connection? It's Jesus. Jesus is that connection. Jesus is, is, is what's it? Jesus is what we call that bridge. The Bible said that he is the mediator. Yes. Come on now. He is the mediator between who? God and Amen. 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 Yes. Amen. Come on. We can't go to the Father. We can't go to the Father. We, we got to, He is that connection. Yes. Yes. Father, in the name, I come God before God. you in who? The name. Jesus name. Yes. In the name of Jesus. I have access. Yes. In Amen. Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Through the Spirit of God. Yes. Christ Jesus Himself. He is my access. Yes. My access to what? Revelation knowledge. My access to wisdom, yes. Come on, yes. to everything. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. He is my access. Watch this now. Yes. Watch this. As believers, as believers, we talked about it in the, in the beginning. We possess the Spirit of God on the inside of us when we confess Christ as the Son of God. Can I tell you? Let's go to 1 Corinthians 2 and 12. Amen. Hallelujah. 1 Corinthians 2 and 12. Hallelujah. 1 Corinthians 2 and 12. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Look what it says. Now we have received, say received, not the spirit of the world. But the spirit which is of God that we might know the things that are freely given to us of God. Just talking about some revelation. Yeah. Know the things that are freely given to us of God. Watch this. That's the only one I said. Mm -hmm. 2 and 12. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. 
Let me go to 13 because it looked it look good to me. It says, Which things also we speak, not in the words of man's wisdom teaching, but which the Holy Ghost teacheth, comparing spiritual things with spiritual. Hallelujah. Let me go down to 14. Look what it says. But the natural man receiveth not the things of the Spirit of God. Why he don't receive it? Because look what he's going to tell you. Because they are what? Foolishness, Foolishness unto him. him. Neither can he know them. Because they are spiritually deserved. Baby. In order you're going to get these revelations from God. They're going to have to be spiritually discerned. You're going to have to get them from the, from the, come on, a lot of people. You just can't pick up the Bible. Ah, what you say? Come on here. Come on now and say, you know what? I know I read the Bible. <laughs> I know what it all, I know what it says. Yes, Baby, you know, you probably know what it says or what it read. But you don't have the understanding of what it means. You just can't read it like Mary had a little lamb. Come on now. Come on. It is the Holy Ghost that teaches us the truth of God. Because only the Holy Ghost knows God and understands God in his entirety. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Man has no revelation of God. No. No. None. He don't even know how to operate. Hallelujah. Man can't do nothing. But man, you know what? Come on, Holy how you how you want how you gonna say uh -huh. that you know everything about God uh -huh. and you don't know even everything about yourself? Okay. Amen. 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 Man, I don't know me. <laughs> I don't know what I don't know me. I think I know me. Come on now. I don't know what I do in a situation when when I, when, I, when I don't have a home or a job or and I and I don't have any money. God hasn't provided with me for. I don't know what I say I do. Right. Amen. Jesus. That's right. I don't know me that well. Jesus. That's true. Amen. Are you understand what I'm saying? A lot of people remember, I wouldn't do no stuff like that. No, I'll never do that. You don't know what you'll do. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you for watching the Faith and Grace Ministries video broadcast where the peace of God is taking over your troubles with Apostle Willie Williams. Be sure to join us each and every week for Faith and Grace Ministries. If you would like to sow a seed into our ministry or just to contact us, please email us at pastorwilliams1975 at gmail.com. You can also find us on Facebook. Just search Faith and Grace Ministries.